Oh, great. Um, what am I gonna do about that? Maybe I can't do anything about it. Maybe I'm supposed to just accept it. Oh, wait, no, I can disarm it. Okay. Usually if I can't see, like, the priming mechanism, I don't try. But that would have been a foolish mistake on my part. Well, now I can open the door. In exchange, I've probably triggered a big death trap. A big old maze of bullshit. We have the heated death. We have the spike, or, well, that's not really it, but we have the spinning bladey death. And probably a lot more waiting for us. Shotgun on the ready. Yeah, of course. Oh, damn. Ooh, nice dodge. Ow. Really nice dodge. She is an opportunist. But not enough of an opportunist. All right, reloading my shotgun and taking the fucking goop back. Don't know what kind of crazy enemies could be in here, friends. Oh. Get back! Maybe into the... Machine of Doom? I said Machine of Doom! All right. That was disappointing. I just want to knock them back in the traps that they've been using against me, you know? That'd be awesome. Uh-oh. Wow, what are you? Let me guess. You charge at me, and I get you to run into one of these instant killing traps. Glory knocks me straight into one! Yeah! That's how it works. Okay. I got gotcha. you. No, I got gotcha. you. I will. I will be more effective. <laughs> Jesus. I don't even know why they bother having a checkpoint just before here. I mean, you might as well have just started it. I'm not gonna forget that there are a bunch of deadly death traps. I was- that was redundant. Still, point stands. Not gonna forget that shit. Hey! They changed models! Alright, I'm ready for killing. I'm pretty sure this lady's dead. Yep. You wanna chow down, big boy? Whoa, I don't wanna chow down anymore. I'm in a bad place! Bad! Awful! Did I mention terrible? I did not expect this guy to trigger so early. You're still alive? Fuck you, buddy. I almost ran into the other trap. That would have been bad. Okay. Uh, this is shenanigans. I don't know what I want to do against this guy because, uh... I don't want to pull a fucking lever while he's directly behind me, you know? What did I just do? I fucked up, is what I did. But he's got a growth on his back. He's 
So that's very intrig intriguing. Wow! Well, I got him. I think. Thank God. Let's leave. What? Hey! Figured out what those things can do. They squash ya! <laughs> and then burn you to a nice toasty Sebastian... Sebastian Castellanos crisp. Oh, we know what to do with these. I mean, right? Does it go back ever? Can't go back too far. Yeah? That's what I'm kind of expecting. I just want the goop. Shit. Oh, there's a ladder out of here. Okay. I'm like, this is not working in my favor at all. You know, I'd say at least the big spooky enemies down, but who oh knows? That was too easy. He could totally be coming back, and his body's not there anymore. Although that could just be a game thing. We despawned his body because you killed his ass. Alright, how am I doing on syringes anyways? I have two out of four. You know what? Let's use one. Just in case. Oh, look! Told you! Too easy! Now he's back! Alright, let's get our A game on, fellas. We're gonna have to shoot the shit out of him, and then shoot the hell out of his back. Examine! Oh, you mean jump down? Oh, that's not exactly examining. Oh, you're kidding me. Ow. Great, now I'm out of fucking ammo. I don't even know which way I had to go. Am I going this way? No, that's a dead end. Ugh. Two! Two motherfuckers! Two of these bitches! You motherfucking kidding me? Uh-uh! No! No, I can handle one! Mmm! It looks like I'm gonna have to handle both of them. Ah! Fucking A! Alright. We're gonna have to suck it up. Oh, Jesus. Okay! These guys have taught me a very important lesson. Uh... Always save your shotgun ammo for the big baddies. Excuse me! Oh my god! I got a double kill. Oh! Oh, thank you! Oh, fucking thank you! <laughs> Oh, explosives! You are my savior! And my ender! Oh, man. That could have turned out a whole lot worse, honestly. I was really sad that my fucking... Uh, flashbolt did jack shit, but... I guess they kind of look like they're blind.
I'm not scared of one, but I was frightened by two, because I didn't exactly have a lot of fucking ammo, you know? Well, that's what explosives are for, friend! Dealing sufficiently large amounts of damage! Sure wants to give me a flashbolt in an area where flashbolts aren't going to be incredibly useful. Maybe it is. Maybe I was just really unlucky with two flashbolts, right? Alright, let's get out of here. I don't know what that sound was. Don't like it, though. I gotta give the game- uh-oh. Oh, shit! You again! What? What? Huh? It just took me to a completely different place. Not cool, man. Anyways, I was gonna say, I gotta give the game props for not just putting a horde mode- or not really just sending a horde while I'm standing by the door waiting for it to open. That's what I thought was gonna happen. Like, just fighting for my life. For a long period of time. Was that- Was that Laura? I didn't get a good look, but if it's Laura, great! Just what I need in my life. More of instantly dying. Maybe I should've been burning those bodies. Uh. Everything I have, everything I am, has been taken from me since the accident by those who seek to consume me. They are in the darkness, with only the phantoms of my mind to comfort me, to taunt me. I nearly lost myself completely. But then I saw her. Deep down I know she was only an apparition. But I would regain my face. Recover what was taken from me. Restore her, my beloved sister, Laura. Uh-huh. It's all about trying to get her back. Kind of. At least in your mind. Maybe... Maybe this is his, you know, I mean, to be fair to him, more sympathy. Oh god. Safety. I hear a mirror. Anyways, to be fair to him... If this is what his mind is like, if these are things he legitimately can perceive as... Yeah, he's got a pretty shitty day. <laughs> Every day is just awful. Oh, okay, I was like, why is it not opening? Oh, there's the journal. Journal of Sebastian Cassianos, February 27th, 2012. I've watched friends and colleagues die before. Part of the job that I've taken, and it's never easy. But nothing can compare to losing your own child. I'd die a million times over to prevent it, but I can't. I felt so helpless when they lowered that tiny coffin into the ground. The pain is unbearable. I know I shouldn't, but drinking is the only thing that's let me sleep for the last few weeks. I'm worried about Mira. This has been extremely hard on her, and her way of handling it has been unnerving. She wants to be alone, has taken to staying up all night, says she's doing hard work to keep her mind off the tragedy, but she seems to be closing herself off to the world. I know what tends to happen when couples lose a child, and I hope that we're strong enough to avoid it. I don't know, man. <laughs> I think it's pretty obvious that things didn't go well. Obviously, he wouldn't know that. Because we're in the future! And maybe we did get sent to a mental asylum. Have you forgotten something? Yeah, probably. I mean, are you Mira? Are you... You're not Beatrice. You're not Laura. Home destroyed by fire. Home destroyed by fire. D daughter of police officer among victims. The bodies of Lily Castellanos, five and... I, I thought I already got this. Police are investigating as possible arson? Uh-oh. Someone burned my daughter. Well, if I was him, I would go on a frantic hunt to lure them down. 
Okay. How much do I have in terms of goop? 27,000. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're good. I don't like the fact that she was kind of creepily standing inside this hallway. I mean, maybe it was just to be creepy, for creepy's sake, but it's like... It's like the mind upgrades are about to become traps or some shit, you know? Alright. Let's see what I can manage. 27,000. Quite a lot. Even though some of the high upgrades I need now are like 30,000 and 50,000. I'd have... it's fine. Okay. Maybe I don't need to have, like, shitloads of sprints. I already have eight seconds, and that's relatively, really solid. So instead, I could go for the Agni Bolts, light enemies on fire with it. Which sounds like a great idea. But I should upgrade at least a couple of things. Uh, let's see. I just really haven't been using the sniper that much. Uh, and we haven't even been getting that much ammo for it. That's kind of like one of the deciding factors, how come I haven't really upgraded my stock all too much now? Like, I was really excited to try and go for the 50 handgun ammunition thing, but the game went from, like, giving me shitloads of ammo to okay amounts of it. I'm not, like, ever fully ever screwed, but there was a point where I probably would have found 50 ammo, like, around the next corner, and now it's more like, eh, I might get two. I gave you three. Oh, enemies are coming up, so we'll give you... Four? Yeah, that's fair. And then Sniper fucking... <laughs> I haven't got shit off of that. Matches, too. Even if I have even though I haven't... Uh, I could throw down a couple points onto that. Just in case. I am starting to build it back up, and you don't know what could end up happening. There might be a point where the game gets really into trying to give it to me. Oh, shit, I have grenades! I should be using these more often. All right, we'll throw it down onto the matches because that's relatively cheap, five thousand points. Uh, I need to use grenades more often, especially against the big guys. Agni bolts. Don't really need that. It'd be useful, actually, though. Hmm. That way, I don't have to craft them as much if I do find an extra one in the world. Critical percent. Increases the probability of instantly killing an enemy with a headshot. You mean... You mean this NEEDS that? <laughs> I didn't even know about that. Can the cyber ever become super useful? I guess to be fair, if you're playing on casual, and the game's giving you, like, shitloads of ammo, that'd probably be solid, but we're playing on the middle difficulty, and there's probably, like, a fourth difficulty beyond the three skulls. So damn. 200% damage would be awesome. But we're fine for now, and we're just trying to rely on our critical damage thing. The problem is when we deal with more big dudes like the last guys. That was a little terrifying. <laughs> that was not something that my handgun was going to be able to help out with. Alright. We're going to save up. And we're going to go for the two or the fire damage of the bolt. Because that might be incredibly useful in the future. Whoops. I don't know what I just tried to overwrite. I just like working my way down from the bottom to the top. It's like I'm never gonna go back to chapter six. But I might, you know, screw up something up and have to go back to chapter ten or like the early parts of chapter ten. I don't know. Like I find out I haven't been recording the entire time. Uh I totally am right now, but yeah. Patrick Higgins. Lawyer for the Victoriano family, last seen meeting with a man believed to be a client. Lawyer for the Victoriano family. Maybe he was finding out who did it. Possibly. 